The knee joint has two major bones, the femur and the tibia. Normally, the surfaces of these bones are smooth and have a soft tissue covering called cartilage. For reasons that are not very clear, the surface of a bone in the knee joint can become soft. The bone can collapse like a pothole, and the soft tissue layer and bone can become damaged and torn. This problem is called osteochondritis dissecans, and is often referred to as OCD. Studies suggest repeated stress on young bones with running and jumping may be a cause. Others suggest changes within the bone could be to blame. In growing bones, the tissues may heal with proper rest and protection. To protect the knee joint, it is important to reduce stress on the bones. This may include using a brace, cast, or crutches. In some cases, the bone and cartilage may become loose and float inside the joint. This can be painful, prevent normal movement, and even cause locking of the joint. If untreated, this may lead to long-term problems in the joint. Surgical options are available for these problems and when symptoms do not resolve with rest. Typically, the goal of surgery is to reattach the loose pieces where possible. In some cases, different techniques are used to stimulate natural healing processes. In addition to providing care, we are studying osteochondritis dissecans at Scottish Rite as well as with our peers nationally in the Rock Study Group. At certain points throughout treatment, you may be invited to participate in one or more studies. We will explain the risks, inconveniences, and other important information at those times. It is important to know that participating is voluntary and your choice will not affect your or your child's quality of care.